How does rice grow? Rice is a grain. It looks like grass when it's fully grown. Most of the rice we eat in the UK comes from India, Thailand, Cambodia, Vietnam, Pakistan and Italy. People in these countries have grown rice for thousands of years. But actually, you can grow rice in most places as long as the plants aren't exposed to the cold. Rice grows in a paddy field. It's different to a field you might see in this country because it's usually flooded with water, which is just how the rice plants like it. The water protects the rice plants from extreme heat and cold and stops the weeds from growing by making the ground too waterlogged for them to take hold. Some rice fields are irrigated with water from nearby rivers. Others are rain-fed areas, containing water that falls during the monsoon season. The rice plants start their growing cycle in a nursery paddy field. After one month, the seedling plants are put into small bunches and transplanted to a larger field to allow them to grow to their full size. The ground in the larger paddy field is prepared for the seedling rice plants by ploughing. They use oxen to pull the plough through the waterlogged field. The small bunches of rice seedlings are then planted in the main field by hand. The seedlings are given plenty of space in the ground because the rice plants will grow to be around a metre tall. It takes three months for the grains of rice to develop at the top of the plant's stalks. When the grains turn yellow and hard, it's time for them to be harvested. In this field, the rice has to be harvested by hand, so during the harvest, the paddy field is drained to make it easier for the workers. The farmers harvest the rice by cutting the stalks with a sickle. Next, they separate the grain from the stalks by threshing it. This is usually done by hand. In some places the rice is spread out, like this, and the heat of the sunshine dries it out. But often, the rice is stored in large silos, and using dryers, they heat up the air to dry out the rice. Once the rice is dry, the rice grain is separated from the outer husk using this machine. Now it's ready to be placed into these one-ton bags and transported to rice mills in Europe.